What's up guys, Vibe and Jivin back with another two minute tutorial. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about peace control and how to do it correctly and apply it to your game in Arena. Before we hop into it, please consider using code JIVENTV in the Fortnite item shop. Step one of the video is understanding there are lots of creative maps to practice your peace control in. They're gonna be linked in the description. I recommend taking each of these courses one at a time until you master each of them, because each of these courses has different peace control techniques within it. One of the most important things while practicing your peace control is that you do it right from the start. So you wanna be making sure that you're peace controlling from behind cover in this map. Practicing this technique will help you get the good habit down. And what is peace control from behind cover? Basically, it just means you're peace controlling from behind peaks, whether it be a window peak or a top right triangle peak. That way the opponent doesn't have any angle to shoot you. And if they try to pre-fire you, well, you're gonna be behind your peak, so their shot will just hit your wall. Just pay attention to how I'm doing it in this video. Peace control from behind cover, get that down. Next thing is you wanna be making sure you're setting up good right hand peaks on the bots when you're taking your shots. Try to avoid getting hit by the bots. If you can get to the point where you can do all this stuff full speed without getting hit by the bots, your peace control is gonna be fire, at least in creative. And if you're just starting out, start slow with it. Don't try to do it full pace right away. Try to get a good understanding of the techniques and then slowly increase your speed. Make sure you're practicing it every single day at the start of the day and try to do a lot of 1v1s to practice peace controlling under pressure and then move it into arena. It may take some time, but you will get it down if you practice this enough. For me to get it down, I basically practice this for 20 to 30 minutes every single day at the start of the day. Do this until you feel like your peace control is at a really good level and then start warming up with different things like aim or whatever you need to practice. One other thing that's gonna help out your peace control a lot is trigger discipline. There's a link to a video on your screen right now. Click that to learn another really important skill.